I almost went to go. Yeah, I know. Welcome back to NGTV Play Super Smash Bros. Melee. Featuring myself, Spencer, and my co-host, Matt. I'm playing as Sam. Smith's playing as Fox. We're here live on Twitch.tv slash NGTV. Midway through, we'll be doing a best of five with some slippy stats. You know, like, there's not a day that goes by. Actually, there's plenty of days that go by. But there's not a streaming session of Melee that goes by that I don't think about shining stats. And how, like, cool that was. Yeah, it was a bitch to get set up, though. Didn't have a jump. Done like an up air instead of near there. Or we could have just nared. What did I afford it there? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I probably could. I probably could have. Yeah. You uh, you threw a bunch of of recalculations at me, like in quick succession, and like I forgot if I had a jump or not in the midst, in the midst of it.
Matt, how often, like, 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 like which type of up tilt do you do? What? What do you mean? Do you do the um, up tilt at the same time as the as as the up arrow, or or the the, the up on the stick, or do you pre, like, load the the stick in the up position? For up tilt? Yeah. Uh, both. I would say I like 80% of the time preload it and then like 20% of the time I'll do like the, the one at the same time. But it's so like, cause I'm like, such, such a, I don't know how to say it, like uh, a flailer. <laughs> Mm -hmm. That I will mess up the up to the lot if I try to just do like the the, the 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 literal like the reason for its name. I mean, honestly, I didn't even realize that you were at such a high stock market. I was just playing. Just thinking about up tilt. I'm like, you know what? I don't really think about how I do things sometimes. So I just kind of do them. Didn't even seem like that shine was gonna hit. Yeah. You just roll four, uh, dash four, and then roll back. Yeah. Nice. You like my shoulder hit, dude? Hmm? Mm hmm? We'll do fucking nothing. That looks so funny to me. It was like slow motion. It looked like it looked like Sam was like, "I fucking got you, bitch." <laughs> yeah, it looked like you're like like Sam was doing something really cool for a second, and then you realize that actually it's uh, completely fucking useless. <laughs> what up, Flores? How's it going, Flores? One second, we'll read that. Yeah, um, I am so stressed out because of schoolwork. I was, I was getting stressed out, so I took a break for a day. I was unable to get back into it, so then I was behind schedule, and I'm scared to say because I'm behind schedule, and it's a huge rabbit hole. Why are you whispering? 
No, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm just reading it. Um, I'm behind schedule and you drive a hold because I'm scared that they will get mad and it's just weird. Yo, I got you. Um, like years ago, Matt and I were taking college courses. That was cons that was definitely a thing. Yeah. Um, you know, if, n not being into it and then being like, oh shit, now I'm behind. Um, the only thing I can say, Floris, is, um, um, you know, it literally just try to catch up and then be like totally honest. <laughs> Because uh, I think in, in this type of situation, if you're not used to doing this work, like, in, in this type of way... Is it high school or is it college? I think it's high school. Because if it's high school, who cares? <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. Unless you're really trying to get into, like, a, a crazy good school, then you should care a lot. Yeah. But, um, you know, like... Uh, the reason why I say like, 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 be honest, is because literally, you're not supposed to be in this situation. You know what I mean? In a normal situation, you might not be having this issue because uh, go going to school is kind of like a there's a certain amount of routine to it that makes things a little bit more bearable. Um, and then having to all of a sudden switch to just go doing school from home, it's a it's a massive undertaking when it comes to focus and shit like that. So I would say don't um, panic about being a little bit behind and just see if there's any way that you can uh, catch up, but don't overdo it. Like, don't, like, uh, overwhelm yourself. Because if you're only behind by, like, a day or two, it's absolutely doable. Yeah, because I tell you, if I was in this situation in high school, I think I would also probably not do everything on time perfectly. I was hoping to get over to the, the side and see if I could wall jump, but it wasn't in the cards. Okay, okay you just went in order. <laughs> what a dumb strategy. No, -uh. I went scissors, paper, rock. Yeah. It's rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I don't understand why Final Destination is such an issue. Because it's like a free win for Marth if they're good. No, I'm saying an issue for Sam's versus Fox. Because you can't out-B. But like... And I just, like, I routinely break you over the coals there. Okay, well, yeah, I get it. I'm asking, you know, besides not being able to up B, why is that place so different when generally Samus' neutral game revolves around F-tilting and stuff like that? Because I take you, I take, like, one of your options almost completely away. That's true. Also, I was just thinking about how I was thinking about this earlier and came to the conclusion that it's also just a big stage and Samus is not that fast. 
So it's hard for Samus to like close the distance. Oh shit. This is best of five game one, by the way. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to get into a normal school because I'm autistic. But knowing it's going on for another month or so. Uh, it's frustrating. No, I, yeah, I get it. Especially since the end of the school year is coming around so fast, you know, you have like end of the school, uh, you know, end of the year, like finals and stuff like that. And you have to study and get all your work done and um, prepare for a, you know, end of the year test, probably, I'm assuming. The best time of year for this to happen would have been uh, like, instead of starting March, you know, like starting November. From an ease of school year type scenario. Yeah. Fox in between stocks is practicing multi shines. You know you're getting dunked on. They also don't set dates when it needs to be finished, so it's hard to be productive. Yeah. Oh, that's. Yeah. That's even more. It might be good to set your own dates. Be like, hey, I'm going to try to get on a regular schedule of getting things done every two days or something like that. I don't know. Because if they're not going to do it for you, you got to find your own system, you know. Uh, Dreamland. Game two. I'm just gonna try to catch up with English first because that's what I find easiest to work way up. Yeah. What grade are you in? Whoopsie. If you don't mind us asking, of course.
Damn. Getting boxed out and shit. I'm playing with a GameCube controller. I'm getting GameCube controller out and shit. Hmm. Yeah. Try Pokemon Stadium. Game three. the air and and everything. Sick. Why did I light my shield down? over a chat for a second. Our camera goes like four by three when we switch scenes. Like 720? Four by three. Oh, it's because the cropping's different. I, well, I know the cropping's different. I just yeah. thought it was funny. Yeah. Is it just because it's. Oh. Wait, what site is cropped? I don't get it. Doesn't matter. We can see both. <laughs> yeah. Fuck it. Um. So first, Matt, I would like to apologize uh, for not bringing the same level of gameplay that forced you to uh, to practice a lot against Samus this morning like I did last week as Fox. Um, I don't feel like I, I, I brought it this episode. Um, in fact, I feel like I played pretty sluggish and uh, predictable. Um, I mean, I think you played all right. Not like... The best ever, but I would say maybe like 
25% worse than last week. I was working at 50% then. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. But, you know, I did a lot of things to change my approaches and shit like that. Yeah, like I felt like I didn't, stuff. like, um, yeah, I just felt like I, I didn't have the, I couldn't find my neutral moments and stuff as, um, like that well. And I wasn't taking advantage of situations either. I wasn't, like, jumping on stuff as, uh, in the way that I would like to, um, which is unfortunate. And I wasn't playing a good enough defensive game. Um, like I wasn't DIing away when I should have, and I wasn't getting my SDIs. I didn't even know if you were going for them. I was trying, but man, I was, it was, it was, it was, it was, I was like gearing up for them way too early, and then and then when you gear up for something like that too early, then like timing it is harder sometimes than just like doing it. Instead, I would like fall down and be like, "All right, you better come up here and up air me," and you're like, "You're obviously waiting for me to up air you, so I'm gonna back air you." You know, like that type of stuff where I way telegraphed the fact that I'm not floating away. <laughs> you know? oh, I, look, I didn't I'm so helpless. I didn't bomb, so I'm just falling down. Like, whoa, dude. <laughs> and you're like, nah, man, you're going to fucking STI that shit. So I'm going to back at you. Or near me. Yeah, or near you. Um, all right, so game one, Battlefield, two minutes and eight seconds. It was an atrocity. I only took one stock. Matt three stocked me. I noticed that. Uh, at the beginning of a lot of these games, I felt okay. Like, we did all right. And then, like, I just wouldn't take your first stock. And then you would take my first stock. And then I'd be like, and I still wouldn't take your first stock. You would take my second stock. And it was like, I, I would feel all right for a bit. I would get, like, a nice little burst off, off on you, it seemed. Or, like, you know, i play the neutral, like, the first couple of neutral situations, okay. And then after that, it was like, uh, you know, it's snowballed every time. Except for me, the last game. I think the last game, it was not quite like that. It was different. But the first two games, this is what it felt like. I felt like I was doing okay, and then I would look up, and you'd still be on four stocks, and I'd be on two. And I'm like, Ugh, what is happening? Um, Okay, so I took one stock. Yeah, fuck it. Um, you rolled three times, air dodged four times, I spot dodged once. You rolled once, and spot dodged... Oh, no. I'm sorry, I rolled once. Yeah. And you spot, spot dodged twice, or air dodged twice. Air dodged twice, yeah. I don't know why I split those up. You had 15 neutral ones, I had two. You had three counter hits, I had nine. I only had two neutral ones, and you had the beneficial trade. That's how you know it's, it's going poorly. It's when, like, you have all the stuff and the beneficial trade. It's like, yeah, have your cake and eat it, too. Uh, damage for opening was interesting because it's kind of, like, similar. It's just that you killed me fast. That's what I feel like happened in some of these. It's like you, you just killed me at, like, lower percents than usual. We're about to get to that, and I glanced at it, and I my uh, assumption's correct. Uh, <laughs> I would say it's not really that correct. The but, only low percent kill I got was like 56. Yeah, but 108% on Battlefield? Yeah, with an like, smash? Like, like around 100%. Like, you used I, the Project Plus. Well, uh, Where up smash doesn't kill anymore. Well, no. I mean, I, I do expect it to kill at that percentage, but I guess um, when I'm playing better, I tend to have more like over 120 percent stocks yeah um and i just you know obviously didn't your inputs were 344 and mine were 339 so we were close to the same inputs so we were kind of in sync you could move two up airs and up smash and a down b and i killed you with the neutral air um you had a, a 35 percent combo on my first stock last uh, second stock. my second stock also yeah sorry i was thinking about my stock when i was reading your your thing look at that i had a 33 percent combo and it's like it didn't hit the thresholds of 35%, apparently. So I'm not going to turn it yellow. <laughs> uh, but you had a 35% combo on my second stock, a 43% combo on my third stock. And then my last stock, you just, like, I think you just shined me to death yeah. or some shit. They didn't shine you to death. But you, I think you I just, hit like, you with, like, two stage. shines. Yeah. Dreamland, game two, two minutes and 51 seconds, which should just not happen. Um, you rolled five times. Air dodge once, spot dodge once, and I uh, just air dodge three times and spot dodge once. My damage per opening was the same practically. It was like almost almost exactly the same, but yours went up by three. So, okay. Your neutral ones were 16, mine were three. 
Your counter is for five, mine were ten, but I got the beneficial trade. You had three wavelengths, I had one. Nice. Your inputs went down to 301. Mine went down to 311. Uh, you come with two up smashes, an up air, and a forward smash, and I killed you with a neutral air and an up B. Yeah, that last kill doesn't count. Well, it doesn't because I just let you kill me because if I had up B, then you no. would have survived. Yeah, I know. It's just funny. That one, no. <laughs> you, you had a 59% combo on my first stock. A 38% combo on my second stock, a 49% combo on my third stock, and an 88% combo on my last stock, going back to 1955. Back to the future, 88 miles per hour. Mm. What play? Was that last combo I did was pretty sick. Come on, you can do it. You know what it was is like a lot of my my stuff didn't feel like it really flowed i didn't feel that flowy. laser don't i take one of these stocks no i, I took two stocks this game you did but it doesn't count oh i see oh th yeah this one yeah yeah that was crazy that was yeah i remember that now yeah that was crazy game three pokemon stadium two minutes and 44 seconds I took one stock. It was like the quickest friggin' shit ever. Um, we had time to watch a, 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 a replay only at 32 minutes. We've been having short episodes lately. Um, let's see here. You rolled six times. Air dodge three times. Spot dodge twice. I air dodge twice. Spot dodge once. Dude, I just destroyed you in the neutral game. You hardly ever see Fox with like this big of a gap between neutral and we're dropping frames. Oh boy. Okay. Well, let's get to this quick then. Um, yeah, you had 20 neutral ones. I had seven. You have five counter inside nine. Uh, you wave landed twice. I wave landed five times. So apparently my shit was in order. I was, I'm going to wave land. I'm not going to win, but I'll wave land. I did a cool wave land thing to avoid an attack once too. It was nice. Um, your inputs were two, 277. Mine were 269. You come with the back air and up smash, a forward smash, and a down B, and I killed you with an up tilt in the middle of the stage. You had a 48% combo on my first stock. Then a 52% combo on my second stock. And a 53 on my last stock. We kind of discussed it throughout, but I mean, is there anything else specific you wanted to mention? Uh, just like neutrals, where it's crazy, but we need to... Yeah, we're, we're going to call it. Um, all right, name for the episode. Uh, Neutral Fox? No. Uh, uh, training pays off. Training pays off. Okay, cool. So we're going to call this episode. For those of you on the stream, we're not going offline just yet. Actually, we are, but we'll be right back. Uh, f f uh, so stick around. We'll be right, we're right back in a second. We're going to restart the stream. But for those of you on YouTube, check us out live on twitch.tv slash TV. We'll see you guys next time. Peace. All right, we'll be right back. <laughs> 